Mr. President, Mr. Deputy President, and all the important guests present here, my friend, my brother, Eden Duale, and your wife. Your Excellency, the President, allow me to also say I'm delighted to be here. Number two, to say that I'm privileged to have been a friend of Eden Duale for many years, even before I joined Parliament, we knew each other with Eden Duale because of the ICC. In the years preceding the 2013 election. And we spent very many days and nights agonizing when we were in trouble and celebrating whenever we had breakthroughs. We don't have time to recall so many things that we can say. But uh, Eden Duale, you've done us proud. Unlike uh, my brother Kipchumba, I, my book is also on the way. And um, that is the way to go. President Ruto has taught us, those of us who have learned leadership under his feet, he's taught us loyalty. And tonight, there is no greater testament of what loyalty does than to see my brother Eden Duale launching his book here as the Cabinet Secretary for the Defense of Kenya. It's amazing. My brother, I think you have still some reward, even greater rewards, in the days ahead for loyalty. The only caveat is that unlike betrayal, loyalty is paid in installments. Betrayal is the one that is punished instantaneously. But betrayal, uh, loyalty is paid in bits and pieces over time. You have shown us and you have proved to us that the world has no place for betrayers. And I have no doubt in my mind that the painful moments we went together were to prepare us to happier and greater moments. Lastly, Um, Eden Duale is many things, very many things. But the one thing I've learned about him is that Eden Duale is a very conscientious and religious person. He's a man of faith. I have learned the lesson for those of us in politics and public life, as much as we do what we must do in the public space, we must take care of our private, spiritual, and family lives. And I have very many examples because I have interacted with Eden Duale at very close and personal levels. And I have learned that that separation is very important. And lastly, 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 many people believe politicians love money. Eden Duale and his experience has proved that not all politicians love money. Because if it were about money, at the time 
when it really mattered, at the time when the issue is the issue before us, and when I say us, is many of us in this room. The issue was, it's either you betray William Ruto and get all the money in the world, or you stick with him and pay the price. Eden Duale chose to stick with his friend, the president. And for the younger politicians, please, friendship, loyalty, truth is superior to power, money, and betrayal. God bless you, and God bless you, my brother. Congratulations, Eden Duale. Thank you, Professor Kithure Kendiki, Chief Cabinet Secretary, Interior and National Administration. Allow me now, Your Excellency, Mr. President, to welcome back the Defense Cabinet Secretary to this stage with the rest of the running order. Thank you, Waziri. Your Excellency, what we agreed with Isaac Ruto, he didn't say it. Last night, when he was in Bomet, I told him, please uh, don't revisit uh, when we were in uh, Narok University on this morning of uh, Yipesa. But he assured me, he'll say that uh, Sasa is a Kale Mama Yetu, <laughs> which he did not say. <laughs> Your Excellency, let me just one minute before I invite uh, the Honorable Attorney General, let me just uh, thank uh, Honorable Sankok, uh, our former nominated MP. This man stood with me when we, when we were sacked. We formed a caucus of uh, Cecil Mbarire, Alice Wahome, uh, Kimani Ichungwa, who is in the U.S., uh, and many others. And he, every day he was diligent. And at times he, he could cause chaos by defending uh, our cause. Yes, uh, in this gathering, there are members of my family, extended family, my brothers, my sisters, uh, and I want to recognize them. Let me now call the, a man who I served with for seven and a half years as my leader at the Speaker of the National Assembly. He has uh, some chapters, and I allow him, after he finishes, he invites the Speaker of the National Assembly, and the Speaker invites Honorable Musalia Mudavadi, and Honorable Musalia invites the Deputy President to invite you, sir. 